Hello again, Double Talk 73 here, the fisherman's friend. What I'm going to try to show you this time is how to catch the green ogre gar in North Carolina. And uh, they're not hard, they're, it's just time consuming. And I also want to show you something else that uh, a lot of people I found out did not know. If you click on your name, either on the map page or on the inventory page, okay click on your name that gives you all your uh, uh, records biggest fishes and whatever over here all this information tournaments you've been in but over here on the right it gives you challenges that you can do and they're they're many and varied and uh, finish the, the the tutorial tutorial however you want to say that uh, leprechaun catch 50 leprechaun fish uh, for the uh, during uh, St. Patty's Day you get seven gold coins a clover spoon uh, rowdy bass rodeo catch 50 rowdy bass and you'll get seven gold coins and an Irish bass jig that's funny Irish jig okay uh, Ghostbuster catch 150 ghost pike and you get the 14 foot 10 inch uh, fire phoenix rod and a lot of guys are, are really going out it, it's kind of hard to do when you catch 100 or excuse me catch 200 uh, fish using candy bait and you get a uh, hell troy 23 foot rod okay this is the one we're going for right now grab your pitchfork your torch and pitchfork and go for uh, green ogre gars okay if you catch a hundred you're gonna get the psycho killer best I don't know what that would be unless you're a psycho <laughs> but for 30 uh, I just got them and you're gonna get 13 gold coins okay and if you'll uh, wait for your cooldown <coughs> excuse me they just bite at night they're not gonna bite during the day they just bite at night and here's the rigs we're going to be using. I'm going to use a, uh, I'm using three down rods and one float rig. They all have a five aught hook and a pig's eye for bait. The pig's eyes you get out of pumpkins as you're roaming around. Okay. Uh, this is all three rod, down rods are the same. Use a single bell. Just let us know what's going on. Uh, Ten foot two heavy chaser Leviathan. Uh, 10,000 reel uh, 025 fluoro 8 ounce sinker 02 mono liter 5 watt hook and a pig's eye all three of them are exactly the same number five I'm going to use a float as well because not everybody's got down rods so hopefully we can catch one with a float as well uh, if we don't we don't that's this is the rig we'll be fishing the same spot as we will with the down rods a Brutus 910, Thunderspin 4500, 025 Fluoro, the glowing pear shaped float, 5 aught hook, and pig's eye. Okay. So we're going to go to North Carolina. So make sure you got a license. Mine ends at 255 tomorrow. Okay. We're not going to be using our canoe. And I'm going to show you where we'll be fishing. Uh, daytime I'm going to show you but then at night this is where we're going to spawn in is a great parking job I don't really think so <laughs> hmm. I have I'm in Tennessee I've seen parking jobs like this believe me and they're not too great okay we're going to walk down over here go to the right now there's not a whole lot of space here to put down your uh, rod holder if you're using. There you go. That's pretty cool. That went right on down. Okay, we're going to start with our number one rod. Okay. Now if you see my marker there, right around in there is where we're going to be fishing. Right around in there. Right off the corner of the top of that truck. That's very well parked okay let's check our weather like I said we 
only going to be fish at night peaks. So we got 11 to 11 p.m. to 1 a.m. night peak. So that's where we're going to fish. We're going to advance our time to 11 p.m. Now, some people use these arrows. I use the wheel on my mouse. I can go a little faster, judge it a little better. That's just that's just the way I like to do it. Okay. So let's see what we can do. I think they're about 55 feet out, roughly. Yeah. Give or take a few. And this is just patience fishing. It's not like catching pike or catfish that they're going to jump on your line every two or three minutes. It's just patience. Remember in my videos before I've told you. PPP. Practice, patience, and persistence. That'll pay off. And once you catch your first one over here, you can set you a marker up. And all you gotta do is when you when your rods are all out, hit your M button. Go there, and you uh, hit this little plus as to set your mark where you caught your last fish. That'll open up, and then you annotate it. We got a 60-inch leader on the float. We're using a 5 aught hook, and you can also use bottom rods. That's my annotation. Once you annotate, if you just close it out, it's gone. You come down and hit this check mark. Okay, and that tells you that's good. We're partly cloudy, and uh, the one I caught was 44 pounds, so pretty nice. Turn my light off so I can see them better. Okay, number three. We got one. Well, thank you. It didn't take long. Eight minutes, game time. There we go. Forty pound green ogre gar. Let's see what we look like here. Now, when you get there, you can press the H key on your keyboard. That gets rid of that. And then you use your arrow. You can come in up and down. Use your wh wheel on your mouse come in closer and you can take the picture you want to take okay and there we go that's how easy it is well like I say it takes patience but if you like my videos please subscribe and click on that bell whichever side it's on so that you get notified when I put up some new videos so I appreciate you thanks for watching uh, if you ever see me out in a game Ask me questions. I, I'd love to help you if I can. If I know the answer, I'll jump right on. If I don't, I'll do the best that I can to find out. In the comments on any of the videos, if there's something you'd like to see, uh, a fish you'd like to see me try to catch, or, or a video you'd like to see, put it in a comment because I, I read the comments at least once a day. I try. And I'll answer your comment. And then hopefully, if you need a video or something, you'll see it posted in a few days. Uh, that's about it. So thanks again for watching. Tight lines. Good luck. God bless you and your family. Families. And uh, may the Lord be with you. So I'll catch you later. And y'all come back now. You hear it? Subscribe.